welcome to the Rico Coliseum and the architects of the antiquated attics this afternoon. Mark Awuya for the Marlies, the Stockholm Sweden native and a free agent acquisition. And Calvin Pickard, a native of Winnipeg and a second round pick of the Colorado Avalanche, get the start in goal today. Here's a two on one break. Here's Walker in over the line trying to come to the front of the net. A shot right out of Awuya. Makes the save and he holds on. The first big save for the Marley Netminder. Back to Gardner. Seconds remain in the power play. Paul Ranger into the corner. Across ice pass to Gardner. Scores! What a one timer there from Gardner. Now, he didn't play last night, but he gets a, gets a chance to play tonight. And what a pass. Like right through the seam. And Erie doesn't have any sticks down in that passing lane, and Gardner just sneaks in from the point, and he makes no mistake with a quick release that Pickard really didn't have any chance at all on. Out back to the blue line, it comes. Guys, for shot, there's a rebound! And Pickard somehow awaited D'Amigo, who was not able to elevate the puck. Kadri holds, now working back to the blue line, fires it on the backhand in for a coin, back of the net for Fratton. Bratton looking in front, goes back to the blue line, over it comes to Geispers, a shot, scores! Kadri! I don't think he got a stick on it, but he might have got a shin pad on it. He did. But it's in the net. And a nice little cycle here with a minute and 35 to go by the Marlies. They keep the puck alive. And then D to D and Kadri right in the slot, just drifts out and he does redirect it. He may have got a stick on it, Joe. Certainly he was trying to redirect that with his body there. Off his leg, you're right into the net to give the Marlies the 2-0 lead. Gardner to the near side to Kadri. He tried to feather it through the box. It didn't work. Now Gardner's got to hurry. He can't get to it in time. Malone in over the line. Right on goal, the score! Vander Golik jumping into the rush. And an ill-advised pass across the box from Kadri put Gardner in a difficult position. And when he thought he might get to it in time, he did not. Nothing else. It has certainly given the Maple Leafs a lot of depth. Here's a rolling puck in front. They score! Jake Gardner's rush ends up with the puck in the net. Not sure he's going to get credit for it. But he got it to the blue paint, and that created all kinds of trouble. We didn't see this a lot last night, and we're seeing a lot more of it tonight. Look at Gardner here, that little give and go. Then he takes off with that wide skating strand, stance, brings it to the net, and he just pushes it towards the net. Lake Erie get it out at center ice. Andrew Agazino getting it in over the line. Geisper is his upended, so is Scott. Puck is back at the net. Now it comes a front, they score! That's snuck out there very quickly, and Andrew Agazino is going to take credit for it. But two Marlies fall going back into their own end, and Agazino takes advantage of it. When is uh, Paul Hendrick bobblehead night? Uh, <laughs> I'll tell you, the Zygamanis bobblehead is real. They've got it even like the five day growth. Oh, nice. Very which, good. Which for Mike would be one minute. The score! Ryan Hamilton! Welcome Dave Poland to the broadcast booth. The Marlies have restored a two-goal lead. I think I'm the key here, guys. All right. Well, it's <laughs> really smart pass down low from Spencer Abbott. Good play by Spencer Abbott right here. Let's wait a second here to make sure they don't get a chance. But he looks like he's going to be an NHL scorer from all indications. I know there's a big gap, but here's Abbott stealing and getting it in front of the score. Hamilton finishes it off. Dave Poland, another great pass from Spencer Abbott. Nice little subtle dish in the back end there. Neutral zone turnovers. We see it so often. And then the ability to turn it Excuse back in a hurry. This is Dave Poland's replay. Sorry, Mr. Poland, <laughs> after you, sir. Good positioning by Spencer. Real good positioning. Middle of the ice. He watches the puck come off the boards on the turnover. And then straight north, right away. Boom, quick step, straight north. And he's a passer. He's looking to feed this puck right now. Watch the hole he picks between the D skates and his stick. Alver trying to work his way out. Gets it back to Scarbosa. Scarbosa cross ice pass scores from almost the goal line. Thomas is able to chip it in right along the goal line and up over Awoya and into the net. I'm pretty sure that wouldn't have counted. 
Had it gone in. That was as good a soccer kick as you're going to see. Now back the other way for Lake Erie on a shot right on, and that was stopped by goaltender Marco Uya. Good hockey people, I got to tell you. Ontario, yeah, Scarbosa in with a shot, and Lurge had to go off the shoulder of Uya over the net. Here's a loose puck shot. Oh, what a glove save made by Marco Uya. Kicker goes to the bench for an extra attacker. Two goal deficit here, and Lake Erie trying to pull it out. They score! Right away, Mike Conley in front of the net. Banks that home, and there's a minute 44 to go, and it's a one goal game. Here it is. This is brought in, and the Marlies are going to win three straight on this weekend, including back to back wins on home ice.